Well, the move comes after an employee at one of those stores tested positive for coronavirus. Well, KCAL Line Orange County reporter Stacy Butler is live tonight in Costa Mesa with the very latest for us. Stacy. Yeah, Susie and Jeff, the shutdown happened one hour ago, and I can tell you in that time, we've watched a steady stream of shoppers and employees driving out of South Coast Plaza as they prepare for this unprecedented shutdown. You don't want to panic, but then you don't know the outcome because they're shutting everything down. So it, it's crazy. Rattled nerves in Costa Mesa tonight as shoppers learn one of the busiest malls in America, South Coast Plaza, is shutting down for two weeks after an employee tested positive for COVID-19. That's a really long time to sh shut down the mall, but I guess, you know, if you need to do what you need to do to keep everything good, then make make sure that it doesn't spread, then that's what we have to do. I think it's insane. Like just um, the amount it's escalated in the last week is crazy. A mall spokesperson won't say where the infected employee worked, but now almost all of the 270 plus stores and restaurants are now closed. In a statement just issued, South Coast Plaza says, it is with sadness that we report an employee in one of our stores at the center received news last night of testing positive. We understand the closures of public gathering places in Orange County now needs to happen as soon as possible for a chance to meaningfully stem the pandemic. Anytime something hits close to home, it just, it makes it real. You know, when we heard that Tom Hanks had it, I felt like a lot more people just were like, oh my God. Now the South Coast Plaza is being closed down. And again, I live really close, so that's just like, that's too close to home for me. And uh, I just feel like I have to wear my mask whenever I go out in public. And South Coast Plaza says they hope to reopen March 31st, but you guys know well enough that this whole situation is changing day by day. So it's anyone's guess if that is an actual target date for a reopen. That's the very latest from Costa Mesa. Back to you guys in the studio. Stacy, thank you. Of course, if anything changes, we'll keep you updated here on KCAL 9.